Here's a quick tutorial for homemade face paint with things you might have around the house. Um, I did some experimenting and I'm using body lotion, water, food coloring, and cornstarch. If you have very dry or sensitive skin that stains easily, you might want to actually use washable watercolor paint if you have it and not food coloring. I'm just using an ice cube tray to mix it in. Again, I'm using lotion, food coloring, water, and I've actually experimented and added cornstarch to my formula. I found without the cornstarch, it was just way too transparent. The cornstarch helps to make it a little more opaque or not see-through. So those are all my tools I'm using. Um, I'm gonna start by putting the lotion in first. I'm using a tablespoon of lotion for each of my colors that I'm gonna mix. And I'm just scooping it into the ice cube tray. Then I'm adding my water on top of that. And the last thing I'm gonna add is my food coloring. Um, the food coloring will change the colors. It also will change how much it will stain your skin. So again, if you have sensitive skin that stains easily, you wanna be super careful about that. Once I have my food coloring in, I'm using the bottom of a fork to mix it. Um, if you mix slowly and carefully, you're more likely to have a nice even consistency and not mix your colors together, which you can see I did in places because I was working too fast. All right, I can't show you painting on my own face, so I drew a face and I'm going to put the paint on the face. If you have really sensitive skin, this is something you could do, certainly. And there I am trying it on my arm first. Um, again, my skin is really sensitive and dry, so it was a little tricky to get it off. I had to do some scrubbing in the end, um, but it doesn't feel dry or um, hurt the way that sometimes commercial paint, face paint can. And because I decided it was too transparent or see-through, I went back and I added some cornstarch. There are a lot of recipes out there that use flour and cornstarch for face paint. Um, but I'm just adding a little bit of my cornstarch to my lotion-based paint. And there's my final product. I know I look incredibly silly, but I had fun.